I wanted to do a women's week particularly because um, I was really inspired by two female friends that first got me into mountaineering and rock climbing. Um, two great mountaineers and climbers and they really inspired me on the start of my journey and made me feel strong and confident in the mountains and we had lots of fun together. And in a way I kind of wanted to give a bit back, you know, living here in such a beautiful space, I really wanted to share that with people and also start other people's alpine climbing adventures and journeys and um, allow, allow women to make a connection and bond and formulate those friendships and climb safely together in the mountains. We've got a truly international mix, so we had one lady fly in from America, we've had people come from Finland, from Italy, uh, Norway, um, the UK and France. Um, we had both French guides and uh, English guides on the meet. I just feel super fortunate that this is my home, you know, I feel like every day I wake up and I'm in, I'm in paradise and I wanted to share that with people. The Ekran is really special. It's a corner of the world that not many people know a huge amount about. Um, usually when you think of alpine climbing, most people think of Chamonix. But I think, you know, for me, this has it all. It feels, uh, it feels wilder, there's way less people. So I wanted to bring a few people here, not too many, <laughs> but just enough to, to show them around um, these, these special mountains. I've practiced yoga for, for 20 years and really I just do what I feel like, what feels good in my body. For me, my, my ritual yoga practice is about preparing my body for the day. So, you know, I'm not looking for a gymnastic workout, I'm just looking to stretch and fire up my muscles. You know, we've got 30 women all asking questions about what they're doing tomorrow and what kit they need, etc. So this is my way of coming out of my brain space and just into being and enjoying, enjoying this fabulous experience that is being a human.